Howdy cowdies, weekly walkabout time at the collector. Got a good sale this week, rock popper rat trapes and nice stuff. How cool's all the silver rings with all the nice opals and tourmalines and moonstones and stuff. Phantom no, comic number three. This is compiled of comic strips from the Australian Women's Mirror. Really cool thing. Number two is underneath it, but the cover's missing off number two. Both pretty good things. I think they're like one of the earliest Phantom sort of comics ever produced. Um, coins, some nice jewellery, little Marcusite angelfish brooch. Uh, more nice jewellery. The rock strap radio watch thing's pretty cool. It won't tell you the time, but you can listen, listen to some cool tunes. Little sew on surfer patches, some nice sunglasses and cufflinks. Ladies' beads, these are cool. The quick sight binoculars and the practical torch glasses. Both in their original boxes from the 60s, 70s. Nice little Samu Noguchi coffee table. Or style. Cool little thing. Nice Victorian chairs, piano stool, pray due. Lovely big pair of leak English made stereo speakers, really good quality. The top section you can sort of spin around and sort of. You know, aim the sort of tweeters. Nice big old painting over the back there by Edgar I know. Got a few of his works in this week's sale. Don't know much about him as a painter, but geez, pretty kind of cool. Nice big colours, good design and stuff. I'll show you the other ones in a minute. Awa, nice little 70s portable, or nice little 70s Awa mini sort of component system in the original little sort of rack shelf. With a nice ELAC turntable to go with it. Uh, costume jewellery and gear like that, some nice Swedish uh, pewter watches, pretty cool pair of ladies high heel shoes with little cats on them. So on badges, big lot of watches, these are cool, three old sort of 70s abstract oil paintings. Uh, little display cases for sort of books and magazines, big cool 70s console 70 series TV unit with the sort of record player and radio. It's got legs in here, but one of them sort of snapped off from underneath, so you'll have to do a little bit of mucking around to get him back on. Records with some good quality speakers behind them. Ladies' accessories and bags. What else have we got? Another lot of ladies' bags and things. Some good gear in amongst there. Some cool clothes. Brand new sort of 1960s, 70s psychedelic stretch label. 100% polyester made in Japan. They're really cool. Great colours. Some Hawaiian shirts. Mexican wrestling shorts, bit of Levi's double denim, jeans and a jacket, sporting tops, gridiron and ice hockey, tracky tops, some sort of 70s western sort of gear, pretty cool ladies 80s gear including the bat wing sort of top there, colourful jumpers, sporting, this is basketball and baseball sort of stuff, uh, ladies and men's clothes, some cool men's shirts, nice kimono, band shirts over the back. Mannequin there goes with some other stuff. Type set trays with some printing blocks. Another nice box of ladies' bags. Big collection of as new 70s, sort of 60s kitchen alia. What else have we got? Some Snoopy gear, footy stuff, and Star Wars. Um, I think pillowcases. Cool big teak coffee table there with a little one on top. Some nice microphone stands. CDs. Nice little step stool. Crafty stuff, two boxes of records, three, four boxes of clothing, three boxes of clothing, and there's some good stuff in those boxes. Just couldn't fit it all in the clothes rack. Kitchenalia, beer, with a kind of cool keg stool, box of records, cool old sort of metal cases, lovely Victorian wire work plant stand, some more records, more stereo gear. Ladies designer clothes and accessories, some cool retro curtains. Another good little lot of mixed records, Iggy Pop, Daft Punk, Queen, other cool stuff in amongst. 70s wall hang. This is nice, Victorian marble top cast iron based table. There's a nice big roll top desk there as well with some um, Aristoc made Featherston design set of four. I think Varna is the name of the chairs. What else have we got? Tessa T21 armchairs down the back. Some Parker dining chairs, uh, big lots of records, ABBA posters, sort of as new sort of 60s, 70s household materials and dress patterns and stuff. Another nice big lot of cases, picnic baskets, lab glass, some more cool 70s pictures, ephemera, tins, brand spanking new, couple of sunbeam things. Some cool bike parts, footy jumpers, nice little box brand new cassette radio, 
There's a nice, the Robin Day swivel tub chairs, set of four. Or box of sort of ladies items and gear and kids toys. There's a nice lot, these three boxes here, full of all the ladies coats and furs and stuff. Big Victorian chaise. Another couple of nice boxes of all sort of, some pretty cool sort of parachute track suits and stuff I think in amongst there. Or typeset trays. More boxes of clothing, all the ladies sort of lingerie and sort of bedwear. Some more paintings by Edgar Ino. Civil War. I like this one, Squalor. 1961 I think it's dated. Cool things, these are nice. Uh, I really like the Monkeys of Melbourne Phantom Lamp. Really nice cast iron uh, stove or sort of pot belly, a little opening upside there. Great that sort of slits down on top, flew out the side. Really nice retro coffee table. Nest of three. Nice little yellow sharp stereo. That's a nice bit, this as well. The Danish uh, take, I think Wickerslow, Wickelso or something like that is the designer. A little cartel Joe Colombo lamp. And that's what we got Featherston Scape coffee table, Featherston footstool. Another Wickerslow Danish take X sort of shaped coffee table. Featherston hob chair. Really cool bar with a pair of stools in great condition. Big spaghetti light show that looks like Ronald McDonald's head. A couple of nice little pair of the mushroom lamps. And he's cool as well, a little red adjustable one. Some old skaties from the 1980s. Cool Lego City display. First we've got more paintings by Edgar Ino. This is my favourite. It's called Morwell, 1 million BC. And I think from what I've heard, it looked a lot like that. Kind of like it, like the painting, like the title. There's another one by him as well, Edgar Ino. I think this one's just called Rhythmic Trees. This is a big abstract, is untitled. And this one over to the right here is called Pinsa. They're really nice things, kind of like them. Shame that he didn't exhibit much or do that sort of thing. I think he might have exhibited at the Herald Sun Outdoor Art Show or something like that in the 60s. Um, there's more good stuff, records. A lot of sort of kitschy china and stuff. Some Tiny Tim record with a magazine and a Frank Zappa album. Some nice Danish and other sort of plastic retro gear. As we've got ABBA posters, these are a nice pair of sort of chairs, fold up chairs with a little sort of leg rest that comes out the front of them, goes back underneath. Cool boots. I like this sort of wool and tapestry there from the 70s of the nudes. Um, Pearl Jam gig poster from 95. ABBA posters or ABBA records. Nice little designer bags. Little one with the poodles, fantastic. Capsella, Austin Powers, really cool painting of Moomba. More ladies' bags, more ABBA stuff, another lot of records. Patty Smith and some other cool gear in amongst. Some more good records. Blondie, Adam and the Ants. This is one of my favourite little bits as well. A little elephant pull-along toy. Any drums. His ace. What else? Little coronet guitar out from the 60s. More ABBA gear. Red phone. Lego display. Nice beaded bags. Good lot of Pixies records. Uh, big sort of 1930s croquet parlour game made in Australia. More ABBA, Ericsson phones, bit of funk. These little sort of goblets are pretty cool. Nice little red lamp as well that all folds up. What else have we got? Steering wheel, the brand spanking new dry clad wading pool. There you go, probably come in handy in here. 70s wall plaque, Queens of the Stone Age gig poster. Cool big tribal club. Box brand new Pi uh, double cassette deck, ease of cracker, old accordion there, pretty much mint in its boat case, some nice 70s ceramics, 70s Pyrex glass, more ABBA records, picture discs, more records, a little box kids interlocking building cube game or set, Mason Pearson hairbrushes, these are great as well, Cookie Pig. These little tail that sort of spins around. And little Fisher Price Bumblebee as well. Got the, both got the original little Myers price tags on them. Little warming sort of deco tea set. Oz Pottery, good little lot. Jucket, Jackman, Harry White, Elvis. Good lot of records again. Brand new Tinker Toy set in its little um, tube. Kiss Vitabrits poster. And also we got Japanese baseball pennants. Bright orange plastic sort of jar. 
Some more packaged and sort of as new kids toys. Lucy Atwell hankies. Little red phone set in its box. All sort of new ping pong gear. Kids cutlery sets. Kids toy sort of kitchen gear. Box brand new Chevy Impala model kit. There you go. Three jars of AJC melon jelly from about 1909. It's the back end of a Boomeroo tractor. Some Rubik's clocks. Lincoln log set. ABBA, Bugs Bunny, Tales number one comic. A couple of good records, Hendrix, John Lee Hooker. White Fries glass in boxes. Another lot of records, good stuff in amongst. Bags, boxed as new pedigree doll. Some more ladies' bags. Nice lot of sort of colourful Australian and New Zealand ceramics. More ABBA. Brand spanking new Canamat can opener. Nice little retro clock. Some more good records. Nice little collection of umbrellas and parasols. The hat block's good too. Isomat ice crasher in its box. Tommy talking phone kit. Some nice glassware. And a nice little bit of Art Deco cartonware. Cool stuff down the bottom. Some old fiberglass skateboards hang 10. And the Pike surfboard one's a ripper. It's got a little kick tail on the end there. It's probably pretty early for a little kick tail I'd be thinking. Good coffee machine, Home Guard Ghoul Vase, designed by Otto Bauer. Uh, big one of TG Green. His nice little wall plaque, cool retro clock. Fantastic little spinning top in its original box. This is a 1977 Ford sort of cardboard two door coupe that won Bathurst. It's got a ticket on the bottom there from Bathurst as well. Good original condition that's in. Brand new Fisher Price cackling hen toy in its box. Brand new set of roller skates as well that we had to sort of struggle to keep Wayno off them. Volkswagen, Bandai Volkswagen Beetle in its original box. In great condition. Little boxed or little as new Airfix Aerial Arrow motorbike model kit there. Some cool retro cups and saucers. Little pair of pussycats. Japanese cookie jars. The robots are really cool. Big box, boxed sort of rocket there, probe force number one, friction drive, space world organization. Really cool thing. Pierre Fonds French art pottery jug. A couple of brand new Joy Toy Mickey Mouses in their packets. Big Italian art glass fish. Midwinter woofer dogs. He's another good bit as well, the Bandai Ferrari with a sort of retractable convertible top. Monkeys of Melbourne. Good Beatles World Record Club, I think it's an Australian pressing LP. And a really cool Japanese tin toy police car that works with a siren. Really cool. There's some great stuff in the sale this week, guys. Hopefully you saw something you liked. You know, there's other stuff kicking around like bad masks. More ABBA stuff. Old bubblegum wrappers. Heaps of good stuff this week. Hopefully you saw something you liked. See you on Thursday night.